Stephen Phillip is the winner of the Australia category in the 2018 Australian Songwriting Contest. Uh, his song, A Changing Landscape. Welcome, uh, Stephen. Thank you. Uh, tell us a bit about the song. What's changing in the landscape? The song was actually written about my father. Um, we did a trip out west together and, and uh, sort of recouping of the old days and where we grew up out west. And uh, upon our return, when we split ways and I went north and Dad went south, we um, had a bit of time, my brother and I had a bit of time to reflect on the river and, and of the time we'd had with him and how he was looking back at his past, mm. where he was as a boy and how things had changed. And just a bit of reflective really on his life and my life changing as the years go on mm. and that acceptance of change and lack of thereof in some people, yeah. I suppose. Yeah. But, uh, the lyrics uh, sound like it's a, a very uh, supportive sort of song for um, men on the land who um, are perhaps a bit isolated, lonely, that sort of thing. Absolutely. Was, was that written into it? Absolutely. And I think the, the strongest message in the song is for um, people to not be afraid to talk <coughs> and also to listen. It's very helpful, I think, for people who are going through tough times or experience a change they're unfamiliar with to talk it out. You know, just to talk to people, talk to family, talk to friends, and if, if none of those people are available, talk to someone who is able to offer some sort of assistance and guidance in the direction where you're going and acceptance of where you are and where mm. you're heading. Mm. Mm. So is that a, is that a common sort of theme in your songwriting or, uh, or do, you have, do you draw on different uh, topics? Look, I, most of my songwriting is very personal to me. I, I like to write on personal experience and things I've gone through. It's nothing I sort of try to force or find a topic that's you know, top ten and write about that. It's mm. just something mm. that I, as for most people I guess, it just comes to me and, and the words flow out and there it is, but it's usually self-reflective in okay. some way, yeah. shape or form or yeah. something that I've had contact with or something that's close to me. So. so what comes first, melody or lyrics or is it just pour out together? I think a melody is always there sort of in the background niggling away and then I'll try to put some words to it mm. um, and sometimes vice versa. Sometimes the, the lyrics will jump straight out that need to be there and then I'll have to find some sort of a, a melody to go with it. Okay. Yeah. You have, a, have an album out, don't you? I do have an album and it is the uh, feature title is a uh, Changing Landscape, mm. uh, 11 songs, so it released in um, July of this year. Okay, and that's um, country genre or crossover? Uh, look, a bit country, a bit ballady, a bit Australian. It's all very Australian. I like to focus on life in Australia and being Australian. Mm. Um, so, uh, yeah, there's you know there's a few funny tunes, there's a few serious things, and mm. all reflective. Some songs were written twenty plus years ago. Oh, really? Made it onto the album. Yeah, yeah. That just fit in with the with the with the album songs. Yeah. Mm. So, do you take the songs on the road? Do you do you perform? No, I don't perform. I'm not a performing artist at all. I just uh, felt this was something I had to do to get these songs out. I've been writing songs and did a lot of work overseas years ago in jingles and. And, and music in general, but that all took a back seat when the family came and kids came, mm -hmm. and there was no time mm -hmm. for that. There was money to be made, so, yeah. so that's uh, that took a back seat. But now my children are a little bit older and had a little bit more time to to get the creative juices flowing again. So I thought it was the timing was right to put it all to an album. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. Uh, and yeah, did it all self-funded and, and worked with a fantastic producer, Matt Fell, oh, at yes. Love Hurt Studios, yeah. and yeah. Um, he really I felt as though he he put the the paint into my sketches. I had a lot of sketches all drawn and he just was able to add the colour to it, which right. was fantastic. So it was a, a bit of a dream to have that done and okay. it feels really nice to have it finished. Good. So your, your songwriting has brought you here tonight as, as the winner of the Australia category. What are you looking for in, in the future in terms of songwriting and recording, not uh, performance so much? Yeah, look, um, for me the studio is where I like to um, to put the colour to everything, so I'd certainly love to put pen to paper and, and continue the journey. Yes. Um, it'd be great to collaborate with, with other artists and, and maybe find someone I could work with. And, mm. and um, But who knows? Who knows? Yeah. So you're looking for other performers to uh, record your material, perhaps? Um, possibly. Look, if the right thing comes along at the right time, why not? Mm. Yeah. It'd be great to work with someone who could put the same life into the songs as I feel. Yeah. Yeah. yeah absolutely. Good on you. Okay, yeah. well, all, all the best with it. Yeah, thank Thanks, you. Uh, Stephen. Uh, Thanks, Stephen. Stephen Phillip, the winner of uh, Australia category.